The illicit international trade in ivory has for many years led to increased poaching targeting elephants in Kenya. However, conservationists say poaching has reduced in recent years thanks to efforts to involve communities living around game parks and conservancies in protecting the animals. CGTN's Enoch Sikolia reports on how people in Samburu County are taking care of orphan elephants. Hey. Behind these locked gates and high walls are over 30 orphaned elephants. Their mothers were either killed by poachers, hunger, or natural causes. In Samburu, Kenya, elephants are being hunted. Poachers kill them for their valuable tasks. Killing mother elephants presents a double tragedy. The largest animal to walk the earth uses much of her famed strength and intelligence to protect and feed her young ones. So what happens when they are gone? This baby will suffer starvation and sometimes may be attacked by predators such as lions and hyenas. Longuro is one such baby elephant named so for being taskless. Longuro was attacked by a hyena upon the death of his mother. He lost his trunk before being rescued by members of the Samburu community who brought him to Reteti Elephant Sanctuary. Every elephant you see here is an orphan. They really need love and passion. And whenever you give them love, they really give love back. So sometimes even they rumble. The orphanage was started to ensure that the death of mother elephants does not result in the death of their young ones. But the stakes are high. The protection of these baby elephants depends on these keepers and rangers. They need to convince communities living around parks, reserves and conservancies that keeping these animals alive is more beneficial to them than any money offered by international criminal networks. Somebody cannot come all the way from Nairobi or from Mombasa or from any other part of the country to come and kill an elephant. They must use the locals who are within the area. Some of those employed here are former poachers, men who decided to put down their guns and embrace wildlife conservation. So what is your success story? We are able to raise so many or several elephant calves that will actually have died. Since 2016, the outcome has exceeded expectations. Over 30 orphaned elephants have been rescued. Ten of them have been sent back to the wild, having matured enough to battle predators like lions. They eventually join other elephant herds in the wild. And we've also had a few cases of uh, mortalities. Because some of them come in very bad shape, mm -hmm. uh, very dehydrated, some with very serious infections. We unfortunately have also lost a few of them. The Living Planet report released last week shows that the number of elephants in Kenya has gone up. WWF hopes that such efforts could be channeled to the conservation of the endangered species like rhinos and in Samburu, the reticulated giraffe too. Enoxicolia, CGTN, Samburu, Kenya.